I compete every day against uh, people that have an Ivy League education or, you know, went to Texas or went to Texas A&M or uh, some very prestigious schools. But one thing that I have on them I think that has served me well because of the unique opportunity I had in college was to be the quarterback of the football team, be the president of the fraternity Kappa Alpha, uh, be very involved in my academics in the business department and particularly in the accounting area. And so I was able to excel at several different areas, which I think prepared me for leadership and knowing how to win. And we had some incredible athletes. Um, what people don't realize is that the number of people that East Texas put into the NFL from that 69 to 72 time frame was pretty impressive. Our 72 team that won the national championship, there were seven players off that one team that played in the NFL. Seven. I graduated at midterm in December and went right to work at Cooper's and Lavram because I had an accounting degree. And I remember going into them and said, listen, I've got to take a little leave of absence and go to training camp for the NFL. And they really thought that was sort of funny. Like, really, you're going to make, yeah, come on. You'll never make it. But uh, I did. So during the off season, I would come back to Dallas and work as a CPA and then be in Cleveland during the regular season. So those two things really, that was the beginning of my professional career after, after college. Uptown Dallas is really the poster child for urban renewal in our country. So what I've really focused on is both on the for sale side and then high-end luxury rentals in in urban infill markets, either in Dallas, Austin, or San Diego. What we find is, is that people really enjoy living in an urban environment. It's very accepted in the cities on the East Coast or West Coast, but maybe not quite accepted in the Southwest. And then the building we're in now is a loft that was built well over 12 years ago that I developed uh, with partners. and was one of the first for sale properties in Uptown. 